people don't think about where their water comes from. They just turn on the tap and they expect it to be there. Those days are ending. Humans are changing the climate. We already see evidence about it. One of the most significant impacts of climate change will be on our water resources. This notion that we'll have water forever is wrong. The world is running out of fresh water. In the last 10 years, major water companies from Europe have started taking advantage of pollution and scarcity. Who owns water? Who gets to make the decisions about water? Water privatization was forced on Bolivia by the World Bank. Water is the most precious commodity for them in the world. It's blue gold. Water is a common resource. Water is not a property. The water sector is going to grow at two to three times the global economy over the next 20 years. The market is amoral and it's going to lead you to selling it to those who can buy it and not to those who need it. They're spending tens of millions of dollars to convince us that bottled water is better than tap water. There is less than one person regulating the entire bottled water industry. People buying this stuff had no idea where it was coming from. The company kept pumping during a, a season of drought. They took so much water, they're being sued in five states. They kept pumping even then. We're fighting this battle, this David and Goliath battle. Water must be protected everywhere. Who owns the water for survival owns you. And that's the picture that people have to understand. It's not a Democratic issue and it's not a Republican issue. It's a people issue. Without water, we have no society, we have no economy, we have no life. People say that, well, water's a lot like air. You shouldn't charge for water. Well, okay. Watch what happens.